on today's video, we are dealing with a dead twin turbo Lamborghini Performante. So what happened? What? Oh, so what were we? Oh, that's annoying. Okay, so on today's video, we are dealing with a dead twin turbo Lamborghini Performante. A dead Lamborghini Performante twin turbo. A dead Performante twin turbo Huracan. <coughs> How would you, how, do, how should I say it? That's fine. A dead. And then I'm gonna cut to the thing and then we'll go in. Yeah, a That's dead fine. Huracan, Lamborghini Huracan Performante Twin Turbo. A dead Twin Turbo Lamborghini Huracan Performante. What if I just kept all of those? You should keep all of them. Okay. Yesterday I go to come in and I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna take the, uh, I'm gonna take the, the Lamborghini today. I haven't driven it in a while. I back the bus out, I go to get in the Lamborghini, I'm like, all oh, the dome lights are gone, or, or, or dead. So I'm like, son of a bitch, the fucking car is dead. And obviously, uh, obviously to uh, get this taken care of, I've heard it's a big ordeal. Jesse says it's not, I didn't look it up. Jesse's looked it up. So we're gonna figure out how to get this thing started and then we're gonna have to throw it back on a tender. So this is going to be a video. If you have a Huracan or a Performante, if your shit goes dead, how do you get it started again? So that's gonna be the video. Jesse's gonna do it. Oh, do you have the keys? Oh shit, in the truck. Okay. Okay, here, hold that. You think I'm gonna do it? Right. Okay. <laughs> Obviously. Maybe not, obviously. Batteries in the front of this car, engines in the back. So we need to get into the front trunk to access the battery, which cannot open without the battery. So we're gonna show you where the manual release is. So in the driver's footwell, obviously business as usual, but if we go up here, you'll see this little orange pull tab right here. We're just simply going to pull on that. and front trunk opens. So obviously front trunk unlatched. You should know how to do this if you're actually doing this on a Huracan. And then in here, you can see this is where the trickle charger would plug in. And these should have been plugged in. Been plugged in. Um, we just have these two tabs, which I can't. So they you just turn them until they loosen. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. And <laughs> break the tab what off. What happened? The tab broke? Yeah, you broke the f tab. Way to go. Jesse breaks the f Jesse tab off. Jesse broke the Lamborghini. I don't know. Yeah. I don't right. know. That's okay. Okay, so. <laughs> Jesus. God. <laughs> how do you go from there? How do you just start <laughs> talking again normally? Where'd it go? It went down here. Yeah, I know. I heard it. All right. That's fine. Sorry about it. Sorry. That's okay. As we can see in here, we got positive, negative. No idea how we're actually gonna fit cables in there, but we're gonna try. Yeah. You could probably get cables, you just need to get it on one. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Well, there's one. Oh, sh yeah, it is tight, eh? Yeah. Well, it kind of gives you. Oh, you have a. It's. it's uh... There's a bar sticking out right here. Bar? Yeah, and there's a, there's a diagram right there that shows right behind it that uh, you should not be, you can see it right there. There's like a green and red little diagram that tells you to connect it to this and not to uh, underneath here. Okay, so in that case, this is what you're talking about? Yeah, but no, you connect it to the, see the, see the hex? Yeah. The hex bar there? To yeah. that. Yeah, run it to the hex. Yeah. Okay. And to the positive. I guess we can just go off there. 
Yeah, see if we got a connection. Yep, so we're that's good. flashing, means we're connected. So we're just on, there's oh, a bar. Oh, there we go, we there's got a the bar lights. Coming off the positive, and then we're on a, another attachment point that they give you for the yeah. negative terminal. Um, that seems to be good. So now all that's left to do is, we, we clearly have power, this light has come on. Yeah. Uh, so now, time to start it. Let's, let's give her a run. Obviously the car was dead. After the car has been, you know, charged or you're gonna boost the car, uh, what you need to do is you need to make sure that the car can recognize the key fob. So what you have to do is bring the key fob, put it, the key fob against, see this little logo here? Put the key fob against the logo while you're starting the car. So, Jesse, hold this. You don't think that's a good place for the camera? <laughs> so, put the key fob, throw it down a little bit so I can see it, right against here. Press the ignition. Oh. Not yet, eh? Let's let it go a little longer. Yeah. how you start a dead battery in a Huracan or a Performante. And then you go drive it and have fun. Yeah, and then you can go drive it. Charge the battery up and make sure you don't let it go dead. Make sure you tender the battery. <laughs>